45 years of staying in the Philippines, this French artist becomes Pinoy through his art. Find out how on Tribe. Striking pieces in black, white, red with hints of yellow and blue. Works of a man who has a 45-year artistic career in the Philippines. Meet Mr. Henri Etev, a.k.a. Dimiliora. This is an exhibition who was uh, made to be black and white. But I generally use all kinds of color. So the other exhibition will be in the Metropolitan Museum on the 13th. And uh, it will be a retrospective, and there you will see all the color of the Philippines. But here you only see restriction because it's a discipline. The discipline of using three colors is very interesting artistically. Mr. Etev came to the Philippines in the mid-60s when he was still in his 20s and hung out with other artists and writers in one of the hospital bull cafes in Manila at that time. Since then, his art has been influenced by his home away from home, the Philippines. The concept here is simple. If you stay 10 years in Paris, you will be French, Filipino. If you stay 10 years in the U.S., you will be American Filipino, okay? Now, I stay here 45 years, so I am quasi Pinoy French. Di Migliora is a self-taught artist who has created paintings, sculpted wood and metal, wove tapestries, and forged unique assemblages. His works are somewhat subtle commentaries on Philippine and world events. The primary inspiration is double. Because you see, you have the, the conscious expression and the unconscious expression, okay? Now, the conscious impression is when there is, for example, a tsunami, you will be affected also to hear the news about the tsunami, right? And you will be affected about anything, so you express it artistically on a painting or a sculpture, you know? That is conscious. But there is the other portion, when nothing is happening, then the inconscious take over and you let it flow like a river. Mr. Etev's colorful canvases or graceful and geometric forms convey a certain kind of playfulness, wit and humor, staying true to the term art ventures that they truly are. I picked this one, which is called Nature and Man One. And um, it's, it's original, it's, um, you can try to make something serious out of it or you can just enjoy it and for the fun of it. There's a smiling face here or you can interpret it as being a smiling face. Uh, there's a phantom but a ghost but you can, it can be also a happy child. It, um, so it's just, you can look at it and be in a good mood. You know, it's original, um, colorful. It's very interesting, very unique. Yeah, it's really a combination of uh, uh, color, humor, and you know, it's it's different. Based on what I'm, you know, seeing on the walls right now, uh, I have a feeling we're gonna come. We'll probably go home with a piece or two, and um, I'm really happy for him. I'm really happy that he's got this gallery. Um, like I said, we're big fans, and uh, I love his work. In spending 45 great years in the Philippines, the artist known as Di Migliora taught himself how to create art and live not through the eyes of a foreigner, but as a local. Mr. Henri Etev is a French who's Pinoy.